Today is World Suicide Prevention Day. According to the World Health Organization, every 40 seconds, somebody somewhere in the world commits suicide. It is also estimated that in a year, almost 1 million people die as a result of suicide. The United Nations Information Center, Unique Lagos, organized a program to raise awareness. The theme of the year's program is Working Together to Prevent Suicide. Parents, teachers, students and youths listened to Dr. Fumi Akiola, a psychiatrist who gave an in-depth seminar about suicide and depression. Suicide is said to be a deliberate or an intentional act of taking one's life. It is the second leading cause of death in young people. Young people, 15 to 29 years old. Some parents expressed their displeasure at bullying and gave reasons for the increase in suicide amongst the youth. We are failing in our duties as parents. We are failing in our duties as people that determine what is right in society. The, the situation is very serious. It's not like it used to be. I would just say bullying, extreme bu bullying should be criminalized. If you go to that effort to destroy somebody's psyche, you should go to jail for it. The students also had a few things to say as they implored on their parents to listen to them and speak kindly. There was a time that I couldn't tell my mommy anything anymore. I couldn't tell my mommy. I was keeping everything up to myself, telling it to my sister. She would tell me that Mr. Lagbaja is doing something and you cannot do it. It's pain. Children are going through depression mostly because of their parents. I know many have many in there have enlisted. I say what is happening, but mostly because of their parents. They don't know when and how to use their words. And words are something that you can't take back. The country director, Unique, spoke about how we can curb the suicide by working together. We need teachers to work with, especially with the children. The highest rate of suicide is between uh, children who are between 15 and 19 years. Those young children. And that is very alarming. And those are interacting with teachers, interacting with parents, and interacting with the society. So it is the society, it is the families, and it is the, the teachers. I'm so glad that in many schools, for instance in Lagos State, you have people whose work is counseling. They are counselors. We need them in the schools. Because the parents these days don't have enough time with the children. So you have to work together, the parents, the, the, the schools, but also the community. That's why I'm also glad that we have community leaders here. For help on suicide, please call the numbers. Nimi Adekombi, reporting for Plus TV Africa.